Welcome back to the garage guys. Today I'm installing my Bill's Pipes exhaust on this uh, 2024 YZ125. And just before I do, let's have a good look at this uh, FMF pipe that's going to be coming off. Just for some comparisons. It's a great pipe, you know, no doubt about it. Love this FMF look. Just always wanted to put a Bill's pipe on my bike. Finally getting able to do that. The Bill's pipe is going on. But let's have a good look again at this FMF pipe. And we'll do some comparisons afterwards. There you go. It's a great looking pipe. Fits really good. It, you know, like it looks good. Like form fits, right? Can't complain. But let's have a look at uh, the Bill's pipe in comparison. Again, this FMF pipe is coming off. So let's get to work on this thing. All right, I unbolted the FMF pipe, and right away, there is some big differences, big differences on these two pipes, FMF pipe and the Bill's pipe for the YZ125. The first thing I noticed right away is the Bill's pipe is significantly heavier than the FMF pipe, significantly heavier. I mean, probably, I'm going to say probably at least a pound heavier. Right, and I'm not sure exactly why. Maybe it's just, maybe they use thicker steel. Um, I don't know, but it's definitely heavier, good, bad, or otherwise. Um, it is uh, definitely the first thing I noticed when I picked up the two pipes side by side. You'll also notice, like I said before, just the thickness of the cone area here on the Bill's pipe is, you know, it's definitely thicker, um, but everything else I mean, I'm expecting it to, to bolt up pretty easily. Another difference is this flange on the Bill's pipe is, you know, a lot more pronounced. It looks, it looks to be a lot better quality. I don't know if you can notice that on the video, but definitely looks better. Um, yeah, so just to, again, just looking at the two pipes side by side. Now, before I install, I'm going to have to take the gaskets off the FMF pipe and put them on the Bill's pipe. Should be easy. And this little uh, rubber piece here that seals up the exhaust and the silencer. So I'll, I'll get that going. But yeah, that's the two pipes side by side. So let's uh, keep going with this and get the Bill's pipe prepped and ready to go on the bike. All right, I've just flipped the pipes over and another thing I've noticed that's different is on the FMF pipe, I had to reuse this little um, thread piece that you put on there so you can thread that rear bolt on. On the Bill's pipe, it comes already with a little bolt that's welded on there essentially. The thing I've noticed though is that like this is the stock screw. I just screwed it in there and it screws in fine, but it that's as far as it goes. It stops right there. So hopefully, I mean, that's the right size and it tightens up nicely because it doesn't thread in very far. So that's definitely a difference. But it's all prepped and ready to go on. So I guess it'll be interesting to see just how good of a fit it is compared to the FMF pipe. The FMF pipe fit really good, it bolted up nice. And you know, there was no issues with it at all. So let's hope that the Bill's pipe gives me the same fit, a really good fit, just like the FMF pipe and the stock pipe. So let's, uh, let's get it bolted on. It is 
bolted on up and it went on pretty easy. No big issues. And what do you think of that? That looks really good. Seems like it's on there. Uh, like the seal's really good on the manifold. And everything bolted up pretty easily. No issues. There's plenty of clearance on everything. Have a good look at it, the fit and finish of this thing. Yeah, looks good all through here. No issues. Yeah. Looks good to me. It's actually a nice big gap there in the water hose. I thought it would actually be a lot closer, um, but it's actually further away. So good fit, really. Happy with that. So here it is out in the sunlight. Looks good. What do you guys think? I think I'm going to keep it. Yeah, it looks good on there. Haven't started it yet. Getting ready to. Kind of savoring the moment. And that looks good. What do you guys think of that? Looks pretty good. Bet you it sounds really good too. So, I say we start this thing up. Get a good feel for what it sounds like. Make sure it's not leaking anywhere and then I think we're good to go. it no complaints and it looks hot that thing looks bad I think I'm gonna keep it on there for sure and uh, yeah what do you guys think Bill's pipe or Bill's pipes is the proper name for it and uh, man it makes it look good doesn't it and it sounds good so wrapping this up hope you guys like that video hope you guys like the Bill's pipe on the YZ125 I'm gonna get this thing out and ride it talk to you guys later